Hi everybody, my name is Horia Perutsu. I'm a developer advocate at Miro. And today I'm very excited to sit down with Peter from Service Rocket and introduce this awesome new Autodesk integration. Peter, do you wanna say a couple words about the integration? Sure. Um, my name is Peter Marquez. I'm the Chief Customer Officer at Service Rocket. And uh, we're really excited to work on this. It's a little bit different than the kind of integrations we typically do. So we're very excited to share this with the public. Yeah, let's dive right into the demo and then we can talk a little bit further about uh, some other use cases as well. So here you can see on our mirror board, we have a design review with our design team and we're gonna use this Autodesk integration to help facilitate and really improve our uh, design processes. So first we want to ensure that we've logged into our Autodesk account. Once we've done that, we've connected our Autodesk account into this Miro app. We can actually import the different files we have within our account. So here we have this house design, uh, and this is something we want to collaborate further on and get some feedback on from our colleagues. So we're just going to use that import button, and we're going to be able to import this file into Miro. And you can see it's created this uh, live embed right within Miro. And this is something we can drag around, put into our presentation, and then we can collaborate and work together uh, as a team on this. So now we're going to zoom into our embed, and then we can click on that button in the middle to expand it. So here, you'll see that Autodesk interface that you're so familiar with. And here we can go ahead and move around the model. We can take different views. We can also measure as well. So you can measure the side of the house to see uh, exactly uh, how far that is. And also we can do different things uh, such as checking different screenshots and going into different modes. So now we want to go ahead and go into the advanced mode. So to do that, we're going to go ahead and click on that embed, click on the app, and we're going to be taken into advanced mode. And this is where we're, going to, where we're going to be able to take some of the screenshots, which I mentioned earlier. So here we're back into our file and we can go ahead and rotate and maybe we want to sit, take a side view. So we can take a screenshot of this. We can just click on that create screenshot button at the top and that will create a screenshot of this and then upload it into the mirror board. And let's say I want to maybe zoom in on the windows or zoom in on a specific feature of this model. Well, we can do that too. And then we'll create that screenshot. And in just a couple seconds, these items will be added into the mirror board. Now we'll have two different screenshots and we can go ahead and ask our uh, team to give us some feedback on these uh, different parts of the model. So. We've imported these two screenshots and now we're just gonna place these uh, into our presentation. So we have our side profile view and then we're gonna also bring in our other view as well. And you can see that there's a little arrow on the top right corner and that will bring us back into the original file. So if there's a couple screenshots, um, if you just click on that uh, top, top right part of the file, you'll be taken to that main file too. Great, so we saw a nice little demo of the Autodesk integration. How do you envision customers being successful with this app? Well, this is really interesting because we're embracing two different use cases here. The first one is how do I collaborate, work with my team to create something special? The second is how do I communicate that to my customer? And so that's kind of new and really, really interesting. We're excited to see how customers put this to use and how we help them deliver on their work. Can't wait to see it as well. So I really urge you to go try it out. So go to the Miro Marketplace, type in Autodesk for Miro, install it and try it out and let us know what you think. Thanks so much. Thank you.